What's going on, people? Hope y'all are doing uh, fantastic. Um, tips on choosing the industry to get into. Um, even if you're already in the industry, maybe you want to look into something else. Uh, basically, what I'm saying is you want to get into something specialized because I don't know if you follow the reefer and uh, drive van market, but the rates, you know, they're 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 pretty much stagnant. And I ain't going to use the big words, the capacity and um, the volume and all. Basically, in certain areas, there's more trucks than there are loads. So everybody is fighting over, I shouldn't say everybody, but a majority of the people are fighting over this $1.25 a mile freight. You can't make any money with that. I don't care what recruiter or what dispatcher or whoever says you can't make any money with that. You know, you're running your truck into the ground, uh, trying to get from, you know, 400 mile run, you know, is it, it, nah, it don't work. So what you want to do is you want to get in something specialized. Now, within drive in a reefer, there are, uh, you can get specialized in that, um, that you have to do your own research, uh, I'm just presenting the information to you. Uh, like with uh, dry van, maybe you can get your hazmat. Um, with reefer, there's LTL, less than truckload. Um, you know, and you know that that pays a lot. It pays more than just a one pick, one drop type freight. But if you're not accustomed to LTL, um, it's it can be very hard on you because you won't get any rest. Um, cause you gotta be constantly moving. Um, and to give you an example of an LTL load, uh, I was calling on loads on, on Thursday, I'm sorry, on Wednesday, the day before, uh, Thanksgiving or the national day of mourning. Okay. I called on the JB Hunt load. Usually JB Hunt doesn't post loads on the broker board. So I called on this load and it picked up in northern Pennsylvania. Um, and it went 200, it went 200 miles. And I'm looking at this thing. I'm like, I wonder what the catch is. So I call him up. He's like, yeah, it's a load of uh, flowers. And uh, it goes to all Target stores. And it's uh, 15 drops. What? 15 drops it picked up on friday <clears throat> so right now you got the black friday shoppers working against you and then you got to go to target stores um with these black friday shoppers and just for me you, you ain't going to do 15 stops in one day so it would have carried over into saturday or maybe even sunday i don't work on saturday because it's the sabbath you're supposed to be re well if you follow what the Bible says, you're supposed to be resting on Saturday. You know, no work, uh, no no purchasing, anything like that. Um, the load paid twenty six hundred dollars. So, but I mean, it, it, there is a reason why it was on the load board because nobody wanted it. <laughs> but uh, you know, LTL freight. There's those type of loads out there. You know, if if you can handle it, go for it. Um, then you can get into uh, tanker. Uh, tanker is, is specialized because not everybody, you know, can uh, drive a tank. Um, there's flatbed, step deck, heavy haul, uh, and the list goes on. Agriculture is another industry that is not something that people, when people get into trucking, it's not something that they just jump into. Um, so that's one of those industries where you need to know somebody. Um, and most of the industries where you don't see advertised, like some, you go on Craigslist, you always see drive-in reefer, drive-in reefer, maybe some flatbed and stuff like this. But these other companies, you don't see them on there because, you know, they're, they're not looking for, you know, the, the, the frequent job hoppers. They're looking for, you know, that you, most people find on Craigslist, they're looking for somebody that, you know, is, is specialized within an industry. Um, so get specialized um uh, coming up 2017 i'm getting specialized um so because i you know these these reef and drive and freight um uh, not unless you got the you not unless you got the hookup but 
this company I'm with, I ain't got to hook up. You know, they had some good freight, but I don't know where it went. Um, so they're scrounging just like everybody else. So, and after they take their cut and then they give me the scraps, I'm like, really, dude? So, no. Um, so, but as I progress, you know, I'll, you know, make some videos more about that. But um, get into something specialized, get into something specialized, get into something specialized.